got hackers. Hey, the, the, the little one inside. Yeah, I'm about to ask him, bro. What's up, boxing fans? Welcome back to the channel. If you thought the Gervonta Davis drama couldn't get any wilder, guess what? Things just took a whole new turn, and it's about to get real spicy in the boxing world. You've seen the headlines, you've heard the rumors, but today, we've got something straight from the source. Yep, that's right. Gervonta Davis has finally broken his silence after the feds raided his house. Trust me, you're going to want to stick around because what Tank just revealed is going to flip the entire story upside down. Before we dive into this bombshell, let's recap real quick. For those of you living under a rock, let me catch you up. A couple of weeks ago, Gervonta Tank Davis had his house raided by federal agents, and it was anything but a casual visit. They weren't there to wish him good luck on his next fight, that's for sure. The feds stormed in with a warrant and left with a whole lot more than anyone could have expected. Reports say they found illegal drugs and a stash of unregistered firearms. Yeah, you heard that right. This wasn't some light situation. What the hell, bro? Uh, you know, people just All right, so what, what, what's your side of this? She's trying to take my car. This is my truck. She, all my keys is placed on the, on the, um, on the counter. And yeah, okay. She took my car key and she tried yeah, to leave okay. with my car. Tank who's known for his ferocious knockout power in the ring, suddenly found himself in the headlines for all the wrong reasons. But here's where it gets interesting, because Gervonta Davis isn't taking this lying down. Oh no, he's got some things to say, and you're about to hear them all. Let's get into it. So, after weeks of silence, we finally got Tank's side of the story. And boy, is it a wild one. During an exclusive interview, Davis went in on everything. The raid, the accusations, and even some shots fired at his former mentor, Floyd Mayweather. We'll get to that tea in a second. But first, let's talk about what Tank said about the raid itself. According to Tank, the feds didn't just show up randomly. He claims it was all a setup. That's right, Gervonta Davis is saying someone or maybe even more than one person, was plotting against him, and he's not afraid to point fingers. I've been watching my back for a while now, Davis said. This ain't no surprise to me. The people around me? Some of them ain't loyal. They've been feeding info to the wrong people. Wait, hold up. Did Tank just suggest he was betrayed by someone in his own circle? Looks like it. Davis hinted that certain individuals might have tipped off the authorities about what was inside his house. And when you hear what else he had to say, things start making a lot more sense. Now, let's talk about the main issue here. The guns and drugs. When the feds raided Davis's place, they allegedly found some serious contraband. We're talking about unregistered firearms and illegal substances. But Tank's not owning up to any of that. In fact, He's straight up denying that those items were even his. According to Gervonta Davis, the firearms were for self-defense, but he didn't know they were unregistered. And here's the kicker. He claims the drugs weren't his. Davis stated, look, I don't mess with that stuff. I got people in and out of my house all the time. I'm not saying names, but let's just say I ain't the only one with access to where they found that stuff. Sounds like Tank is trying to clear his name, but with the feds involved, it's not going to be that simple. Still, you can't help but wonder, who's really behind all this? Was Tank set up by someone close to him? If you thought that was crazy, wait until you hear what he had to say about Floyd Mayweather. Now, this is where things get even messier. We all know the complicated relationship between Floyd Mayweather and Gervonta Davis. At one point, Floyd was Tank's mentor, his guide into the world of boxing, and arguably the person who helped him rise to fame. But over the years, things between them have gone south. 
way south. There's been a lot of drama between the two, with both sides throwing shade and rumors flying all over the place. But in a shocking twist, Gervonta Davis dropped a bombshell about Floyd's possible involvement in the raid. Yep, you heard that right. Tank is hinting that Floyd might have had a hand in all of this. During the interview, Davis said, A lot of people don't know what goes on behind closed doors. But trust me, Floyd's got his hands in a lot of things. He knows more than he lets on. Wait, what? Did Tank just suggest that Floyd Mayweather might have played a role in setting him up? It's a bold accusation, but considering their history, it's not entirely out of the realm of possibility. We've seen how Floyd operates in the past. He's always been known to protect his own interests, and if he feels like someone's stepping out of line, he's not afraid to make moves. Could this be another case of Floyd pulling strings behind the scenes? Now, you know Floyd Mayweather isn't going to let something like this slide without responding, right? Right after Tank's comments hit the internet, Money Mayweather took to social media and dropped his own statement. And trust me, he did not hold back. Floyd said, I've always looked out for Tank, but I'm not responsible for his actions. People need to take accountability for their own mistakes. My thing, my thing is, I've always been there for him from day one. Um, we had a game plan, and my game plan was to help him become world champion and take things to that next level. And I've, I've always been there for him. And just over the years, you can see, I've always been positive, always said great things about him, always pushed him to be great. And, um, but over the years, it's constantly going on the internet, take a shot at Floyd, take a shot at Floyd, take a shot at Floyd. Uh, constantly be disrespectful, constantly be disrespectful. When all I ever been was respectful to try to help this fighter, um, go as far as he could possibly go. That's all I ever did. Classic Floyd, always deflecting and putting the blame on someone else, but he didn't stop there. Floyd went on to say, I'm done with people trying to drag my name through the mud. I'm on a whole different level now, and I don't have time for the drama. Hmm, sounds like Floyd is trying to distance himself from Tank. But given everything that's happened, do you think there's more to the story? I don't know about you, but the way Floyd's talking makes me think there's definitely something going on behind the scenes. Now that spices everything up, Floyd Mayweather vs. Gervonta Davis. How did this begin? Let's break it down. New deal, seven fight deal, which is music to the ears of many boxing fans. You get to see you in action for several more years. What type of names are we talking about on those seven names? Uh, whoever you name, they could be in it. If I name some fighters, can you say yes or no? Yeah. Shakur Stevenson? Yeah. Ryan Garcia? Yeah. Devin Haney? Yeah. Isak Cruz? Yeah, but there's two people I already beat already, but yeah. Errol Spence? Outside the ring. <laughs> Floyd Mayweather? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, September. No. Tiafimo Lopez. Yeah. Out of all of those guys, who do you think is the most difficult opponent for you? Floyd Mayweather. So you know how Floyd says he's been there for Tank? So what about the fact he tried to get him arrested? I don't know about you guys, but that doesn't sound like helping to me. And it gets worse. Want to know why Floyd got Tank locked up behind bars? He got Tank thrown into jail because he found out Gervonta Davis was sneaking around with his ex. Yep, last time I checked dating, someone was not a crime. Floyd is as petty as they come. Floyd has even teamed up with Tank's biggest rival, Shakur Stevenson. That's right, Floyd and Shakur have been training side by side in the gym. With those two working together, you can bet they're cooking up something against Tank.
If you're curious why Floyd suddenly turned against Tank, here's the scoop. Gervonta Davis recently revealed that he secured a deal even bigger than Floyd's. And we all know Floyd's ego is sky high. There's no way he's letting anyone steal his spotlight in the boxing world. Set you off that you was like, I gotta do that. A lot of people don't know that what Floyd do. Uh, he said every, So you feel like it was a sub, like he was subbing you like, oh, he, like. He, that, he was going at me. Mm. He was going at me. Yeah. And I knew for sure he was going at me. That's why I went at him. There's yeah. no reason for me to go at Floyd. Yeah. That's yeah. what I was thinking. Cause it's weird. I feel like y'all, y'all got, I would say love, hate, but it's been like the last interview you showed them love. This week it was whatever. But is that sometimes like, you know, is it just like big bro, little bro seeing things different or what is it to you? you? No, know, it just, it, Floyd don't never, he feel as though I'm about to, I'm about to, I'm at that point where as though I passed him. Mm. And, I, and I'm doing it at a young age, wait, like, when Floyd was 20, uh, 29, you'll see, bro. Yeah. That deal that I'm talking about? Yeah, oh, that's, that's, the, deal, that's a part that's of the deal. He, he don't know about that yet, mm. but that's bigger than his deal. Damn. Wow. And y'all just, and I'm just releasing this is exclusive. it. exclusive, that's yeah. exclusive. Bigger than Floyd deal? Yeah. Take no cap, nigga, that's a lot of bread. You'll see, it's okay. gonna come out. But hey, Floyd doesn't need to stress over Tank's career anymore. Tank pretty much sabotaged it himself with all the drama surrounding the raid. So much for calling out Floyd when you're the one who's about to end up behind bars. So that's all from today's video. If you enjoyed it, remember to leave a like, subscribe, and ring that bell icon so you never miss our upcoming videos. And don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments section. Stay tuned and we will catch you in the next video.